being on the screen it is a story being told and it has uh, the visibility is far more but it is also a very narcissistic medium for an actor uh, i want to see myself uh, how am i looking that's the first prerogative am i looking fine but on stage it's not that it's your energy and and the and how powerful you are as an actor which really works So today we have a beautiful mother and daughter duo, Sushma Seth Ji and Divya Seth Shah. They both have been on the screen for very long, but in this era of Netflix, we want to know more about theatre from both of them. And Sushma Ji has been a veteran. Sushma Ji, where did it all start? Where was the beginning of this this huge empire that you created? I mean, you're an inspiration for so many young actors today. Where did you start? How, how did you end up? In the courtyard of her house. How did you end up? <laughs> Uh, in our home, uh, it, all the women were encouraged to go into the performing arts. Radio plays, at the time when women used to be in burqas, my aunts were permitted to go out and perform in public concerts. And um, for me, my uncle wrote three plays and I was given the lead roles. When, uh, one was when I was about uh, ki seven dili. and we performed this on the regal stage and I played Choti Vannu and uh, then one, I played a 75 year old Nawab, a man <laughs> Oh wow! in Bardikhava. So he wrote these uh, plays for me and I performed in them and loved it. I was encouraged by my parents to go abroad and study. I was away for four years. Divya, you also have followed her footsteps and also you were also a theatre artist. You're still into yes, theatre. I started with theatre in Delhi. First I was part of Mummy's Children's Creative Theatre. Then I did theatre in school and college in the Shakespeare Society. And then I went on to do amateur theatre in Delhi with all the theatre groups. But I was primarily part of the repertory of TAG, which is Theatre Action Group with Barry John. But I'd also done lots of plays with her uh, group uh, Yatrik and Mask and Stage Door, all of that. But do you think in this era where, where we are so fixed to the web series, we are so fixed to Netflix, in this era do you think that this form of performance will, will end at some point of no, time? No, no. Because it's an inherent need to, you know, uh, being on the web and being on, on the screen, let's say, being on the screen it is a story being told and it has uh, the visibility is far more but it is also a very narcissistic medium for an actor uh, I want to see myself uh, how am I looking that's the first prerogative am I looking fine but on stage it's not that it's your energy and and the and how powerful you are as an actor which really works so that can never go away and it's not like it's wiped out because of all this there are few and far between productions and theater groups who are doing such mind-blowing stuff and uh, people do recognize that Be there are there are takers for that too it and is a struggle was, and how was it being a part of Sushma ji's plays was she a strict mother would, would she scold no. you if, if you were not performing well no, never never the whole purpose was to make them enjoy the experience and to build on that and have fun and you know and, uh, yes enjoy and create the process something beautiful and, and the love the love that uh, in in the batches that mummy used to get, I, I clearly remember cases where they were transformed. Somebody came to her who just wouldn't talk. She just never used to, her mother said, do anything, just get her to talk. By the end of the workshop and the plays, she was, she's still my friend today. She's still my friend today. There was another boy who used to stammer. Yes. When he first came, the first one week, we all were like, should we make fun of him or do we ignore him? What do we do? I want to I gave him a speaking I want to imitate him, you know, all this. Within a week, we forgot because he wasn't stammering. No, on stage, he did not stutter, stammer once. At all. Because I gave him a speaking part. I said he will speak because it and was the, a and psychological problem. And the thing with Mummy's style was, it was never a, a dictator director. Mm, that's very because important. Because her we empathy to towards children is so great. Yeah, that's why I can never be a director. Her empathy <laughs> towards the children is so great that it was always from their point of view. It right. was always how can this help this child or how can this child do this better and you do it and let's see. Well, thank you so much Sushma ji and Divya ji for sharing your experiences with us. Oh.